Buenos dias. Good morning, everyone. Hey, everybody. Good morning. It is February 17th, 2024. Welcome to CBS Saturday Morning. Massive penalty. Former President Trump is ordered to pay nearly $355 million in his civil fraud case. We'll have more details on the decision that also bans him from running a business in New York for three years. Breaking overnight, Ukrainian troops retreat as Russia makes its biggest advance in the war since the spring. It comes as tensions heighten with the West over the death of opposition leader Alexei Navalny. We'll have the latest on the death of the Russian president's most prominent critic. Deadly blast. A fire quickly gets out of hand when a home explodes with firefighters inside. Details on the shockwaves that sent debris flying. And the last mile. His first three marathons are among the fastest ever recorded. But this rising star's life was cut short in a car accident just this week. Witness our remarkable interview held shortly before tragedy struck. But first, we begin this morning with a look at today's eye opener. Anyone can do it. Even me? Sure, even me. All you need is long hair, makeup, and tight pants. And we can get that stuff right here in your mom's closet. Yeah, sure. That's right, Billy. Yeah. See, he saw the picture of you on the computer, and then you would go and <laughs> when you would play basketball. And, and who else in the world does that? Her name is Mr. Big Baby Taco Derm. I want it. But she likes me best. Besides, I already got teeth. Uh... Go downstairs. But I must finish my juice box. Gracias! Hmm, nice. Oh my goodness, you are so cute. I think I will call you Juan and you Juanita. Yeah, I, I, I really um, thought that the finale was awesome. No, I got everything I needed after that hug. Way to go, Eduardo! You captured the cannibal ghost! And it was the most delicious badger ever. That was amazing. Good job, Agents Puppy and Caswell. You've done tough proud. All right, I suppose I could help fix the place up a little. This is nice. Everyone's being super helpful today. My name isn't really Francisco. It's Francesca. My mom wanted a girl. I found some ooze. My thirst isn't on the loose anymore. I just want to thank you all for your help. Mount Bear River is flowing again. The other storm drains are painted, too. And the whole map there watershed, too. I was just going to say that. Yes, I saved the forest. You're our hero. I am feeling like me again. Exactly. Yes, more than anything. Yes, sirree, but this is the life. You kings and queens of Woodland Valley. Oh, Naz, I am so excited. I just know that this time I am going to get Count Storm. I think I just found what I was looking for. Try taking a dip in Big Springs, little bee. I'm sure the fish there will get you clean. When there's too many fish in the lake, the crocodiles come and eat the fish. It's the circle of life at its finest. Pua! That'd be awesome! You're really special. Any eagle can swoop and stop. I have to admit, for someone your size, you're a surprisingly good hider. Bunga, your smell must be even scarier than a snake's. That's just how Bunga smells. He's always been a bit, uh, fragrant. If you ask me, I think Bunga smells fine just the way he is. Yeah. And in Bunga's case, he's a stinky little honey badger. Thanks, Uncle Timon. Best day ever. Oh, I agree. Agorific. Pretty. Glad to be almost alive. Really? Gracias. This morning's eye opener is presented by Progressive, making it easy to find oh, that's yeah. right. Yeah. 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 Hmm. Exciting finish there on a Friday night. All comes down to the last shot. My dad used to always say, just watch the last four minutes of a basketball game. All you need to watch. Or the last really two true. minutes. Truly. Or like football for that. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Exciting finish last night. Exciting start this morning. Welcome to the weekend, everyone. I'm Jeff Glore. My name is Eduardo. Along with Michelle Miller and Dana Jacobson. 
This morning, we are going to take you to Louisiana to go fishing for a southern delicacy that's getting harder and harder to find. We are currently in crawfish season, but while tables should be packed with people cracking them open to enjoy, they're an extremely short supply. We're going to hunt down why the little guys have gone missing. Then it was one of the so-called trials of the century, charged with stealing atomic bomb secrets. Julius and Ethel Rosenberg sent Cold War America into a tailspin. Now a new biography chronicles the life of the judge who sentenced them to death, a decision that he would ultimately pay the price for. Then we'll take you to southern England, where these cliffs have been carved over millions of years, but what they house only takes a year to enjoy. It's the birthplace of cheddar cheese. We're going to take you inside these caves to show you how they are still hand-making cheddar after centuries. On the dish, they are two best friends who've been all over the world now bringing global flavors to South Florida. From Indian to Italian to coastal Mediterranean, we're going to meet Mo Alcazar and Nathan Patel. Are you guys hungry? Yeah! Yeah! Yes! A delicious carrot cake. You want to see? It was so delicious, I ate the whole thing. Almost. <laughs> now it's gone. <laughs> and she has worked with Miranda Lambert, Little Big Town, and Harry Styles. But now singer-songwriter Maddie Diaz is about to embark on her biggest solo tour yet on the heels of her brand new album. She and her band will perform for you later in our Saturday session. That and so much more is all ahead. Oh yeah, for sure. Me too. But we begin with this morning's top story, a massive civil penalty for Donald Trump, his companies, and two of his children. On Friday, a New York judge ordered Trump to pay nearly $355 million after finding the former president engaged in a scheme to fraudulently inflate his wealth to banks and other lenders.